Here is a quick video on how to transfer your installed and mapped Embrilliance fonts from one computer program to another. I am going to copy all of my fonts. So if I go to my lettering tool and you'll see that I have all my BX fonts have been installed on my Mac and I'm going to install them onto all of them from here, transfer them to a new computer. So to do that, don't need this little guy, I am going to go to my utility folder choose open library folder and you get a message saying not to change anything and that's fine click OK and here I have my finder folder now this is the embrilliance folder that has shown all of the folders that are on my in that are currently in my um, embrilliance program under fonts you'll see that I have multiple files these are ones that I have installed and um, I want these are the ones I want to transfer to the new computer. So I am going to open a different finder window that I have open right here, which has a disk in it that is called no name. That's just my blank USB drive. So I'm going to take this fonts folder, click it here, and I'm going to click hold, drag, and drop it onto my no name USB. And it's going to copy this entire folder onto that USB. So there it is, copying. And it may take a little bit, depending on how many items you have in there. But once it's copied, this is the entire fonts folder. All of my BX fonts, all the fonts I map with Alphatrix. Okay, so I'm going to close this up, close this up, and I'm going to close my in brilliance. Don't need to save any changes. So my in brilliance is closed. Now I'm on my Windows computer and I have, let me close this guy so we're going to start from scratch. Here is my no name and there's the fonts folder because I just put my little USB drive into my computer. There it is and this is the fonts folder that has all of the um, files that all of my fonts that we just copied over, my little my no name. So I'm going to now open my Embrilliance program. I am going to go to the utility menu and say open library folder and it says be careful not to make changes while well, the folder is running. So I'm going to click OK and it is opening up in Windows Explorer. There's all the folders that are for my Embrilliance program. Let me close my Embrilliance in the background so that we don't get confused. Here is the Embrilliance library folder. There's the one that says fonts and if I open this up you'll see there's nothing in here. This is the one on my USB drive. These are all the files that I copied over. So I've opened my fonts. I've opened the fonts on the USB. I'm going to select all these files by click, hold, and dragging, and I'm going to drop them onto my location here. It says copy to fonts. It's going to take a little bit because it's got to copy all those files over. And now, I'm going to open my Embrilliance again once this is finished. See, they're all copied in there. I'm going to close this window. I'm going to close this window. Open Embrilliance. Click on my lettering tool. Well, first it has to load all those fonts, which it didn't have to do before because I didn't have any. <laughs> now I'm going to click on my lettering tool, and all the fonts that I had on my Mac are now on my Windows computer. Wasn't that easy?